Hi guys, so we have an O-level past paper question from the year 2016. The session is May, June. This is question number one. This question is based on percentages and money. So let's start. Each year, the Reds play the Blues in a baseball match. In 2014, there were 40,500 tickets sold for the match. In 2015, the number of tickets sold was 2.4% more than in 2014. Calculate the number of tickets sold for the match in 2015. The percentage increase between the two years was 2.4%. That means in 2014, it was at 100%. So in 2015, it became 102.4%. That means if you convert this to a regular number, this becomes 1.024. You simply multiply this by the number of tickets sold in 2014, which is 40,500. When you multiply 40,500 by 1.024, this becomes 41472. The number of tickets sold in 2015 were 41,472. The next part says, in 2015, the cost per ticket for the match was $68.25. The cost per ticket for the match increased by 5% from 2014 to 2015. Calculate the cost per ticket for the match in 2014. So, the increase in cost was 5%. So, in 2014, if it was at 100%, we need to find the value of the ticket in 2014. Right now, it was at 105% and the ticket price was $68.25. In order to find X, we need to cross multiply. So, we multiply 68.25 by 100 and then divide it by 105. When we do that, let's see what we get. 68.25 times 100 divided by 105 we get $65, which is the cost of ticket in 2014. The last part of the question says, calculate the percentage increase from 2014 to 2015 in the total money taken for the match. So, let's see what the sales in 2014 were. The tickets sold in 2014 were 40500 If you multiply this by the ticket price, which is $65, we'll get the total sales. So let's do 40,500 times 65. We get 2632500. Let's calculate the sales in 2015. So the tickets sold in 2015 were 41,472. If you multiply this by 68.25, we'll get the sales in 2015. So we do 41472 times 68.25. You multiply this and we get 2830464, which is the revenue or the sales in 2015. So let's calculate the percentage change. So the percentage change would be the new value, which is 2830464 minus the old value, which is 2632500 divided by the old value, which is 263. 2500 times 100. Now, this is a huge number. Let's put this into the calculator and we'll find the answer. So, we do 2830464 minus 2632500. We divide this by 2632500 and multiply that by 100. And the percentage change that we get is 7.52%, which is our final answer. So we write it over here, 7.52%. I hope this question made sense. The complete working of the entire question is present in the description below for you to download. If you like this video, hit the subscribe button. And thank you so much for watching.